Archibald Chesterfield III. Welcome to the Archie Luxury Channel. And today I'd like to make a video about QR. That's right. Archie Luxury is responsible for the Queensland state election being called early. That's right. I'm the one who is responsible for, for Queensland, the Queensland government calling the election now. Now, why is this the case? Well, it's the horror, the horror of horrors, QR, Queensland Rail. See, what was going to happen in Anastasia's world there with Jackie Trad was they were going to call the state election after the Commonwealth Games. Because, let's face it, the Commonwealth Games would be a great opportunity for the government to sit back, look back, and just bask in the glory of being an elected official. See, you'd probably have a senior royal would come out, a senior royal. Uh, you would have dignitaries, heads of state, not to mention famous sports people and uh, celebrities. But uh, Anastasia saw the writing on the wall. She knew it was going to stink. She knew Jackie Trad could not deliver the goods. See. They know that the new gen trains, which are urgently needed to alleviate the pain for the Commonwealth Games, they knew it's going to be an absolute shitstorm. <laughs> they don't want to be in power when the Games is underway because, let's face it, there's going to be a huge fallout. See, this new gen stuff, it's going to be an absolute disaster. How bad a disaster is it? Well, let me explain a few things. Not only do we have the current rolling stock and trains, which are 30 to 40 years old, they're, they're coming to their, well, they passed their end of life decades ago. And um, the thing is, at the moment, we've got a really, really nasty situation. See, most drivers, they're not actually spending much time behind the wheel. No, 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 that's right, see. They're not spending much time behind the wheel because, because there's so many drivers spare because they don't want to cancel services. QR is petrified of cancelling services so they have so many drivers spare. Did you know QR now? QR itself, the running costs of QR and the service delivery we have more, more cost, less service than 20 years ago. That's right, 20 years ago, they had more services, more scheduled trains, and it was a hell of a lot cheaper. So in 20 years, we've cut the services and the budget has ballooned out. It's ballooned out, that's correct. It's really ballooned out. The number of hours an actual driver sits behind the train driving, well, it's really, really fallen. Uh, Helen Glewer's uh, Helen Glewer's phase to bring female drivers to fruition and uh, toilet breaks. Thank you, Helen, for that legacy. That was a great one, Helen. Not to mention Michael Clugg's uh, involvement. It's an absolute disaster. And see, Anastasia knew if they leave it until the games, the games come up, well, it's going to be ugly and nasty. <clears throat> They're running less services now than 20 years ago. And they know once the games are in, it ain't going to be pretty. So instead of doing what most politicians do is just hold out for as long as they come, for as long as they can, they decided to call the election now so that if they do win, they'll have enough time to repackage before the following election. And if they lose, they can blame the other side. You stuffed it up. That's the way, that's the way the um, politics works. So uh, QR, all I can say is I know your dirty, nasty, rotten secret. I know your dirty, rotten, nasty secret. And uh, QR has been so, so vigilant. Did you know photos of Archibald Chesterfield III are on display 
around QR so they know what I look like. They've uh, actually distributed copies of my photos throughout the entire executive team so that everybody knows what Paul Pluter, a.k.a. Archibald Chesterfield III, looks like. Well done, QR. All I can say is you are a disgrace. You are a horror story. And uh, I'm pleased that I had a big part to play in your undoing. I'm proud of the fact I, I seized on Hinchcliffe's ministerial scalp. I'm very proud of the fact there's a wiki, <coughs> there's a wiki entry which details all the shit that I've exposed about you grubs at QR. You can't scare me, QR. The brown shirts don't scare me, sunshine. <coughs> I'm Paul Pluter, rail advocate, rail advocate, standing up for consumers' rights, standing up for the travelling, the fair-going public. QR, you suck. <coughs> Thank you. Keep watching the Archie Luxury Channel for more, for more pieces about QR and their disastrous train set they run.